No, thank you. Good morning! It is Tuesday and I've decided to do something different. We are going to go feed some ducks! Yay! Valeska's very excited. Erlen has no idea. <laughs> um, first we're going to go to Walmart though because I really, really want a watermelon. I'm going to also just get us some some lunch to eat while we're there because there's also a park where the ducks are. And so I figure we go feed some ducks and then we go eat and play. Sounds like fun. So I don't know why I keep forgetting to show, but um, so I did the, the belly cast, which turned out okay. I think I was leaning a little bit, but <laughs> it works. And now I've got all three baby casts, all three belly casts for all three babies. So this one is Velasquez, the very first one I did. This one is Airlens. And this one is Kiehl's, which got a little leaned, but... These two were done about 36 weeks, and this one was done 37. Yeah, um, eventually I'm going to decorate them. I want to incorporate like their name and maybe their birth weight, birth height, date, and time. Not sure, but I want to do something along those lines, and I have to find the time to do it. <laughs> so for now, they will remain blank. But eventually I'm going to decorate them because, because, um, it's one of the reasons I get very sentimental over things I do. 
and this is one of those things and I just I don't ever see me hanging them up anywhere or doing anything with them <laughs> but I can't get bring myself to just throw them away. And I was talking to somebody at a park yesterday about that and she completely agreed with me. I mean, it's like uh, she like she said, it's like uh, a child's first tooth. It's really hard to just throw it out when they first lose that one tooth and because there's so much like sentimental value or not value, but moment you know what I mean. <laughs> and so these also have it and I don't ever really see myself getting rid of them, but we'll see. Are you ready to go feed some ducks? Hey, hey, are you ready to go feed ducks? She's being a grouchy grouch today. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, you got the bread? Don't eat the bread. The bread is for the ducks. Yes. We're gonna go feed ducks again. <laughs> we ran out of bread. All I had was two, I think two, um hot dog buns and i thought it'd be enough but they were eating it uh so it wasn't enough so we're gonna go do it again and have some fun and then go to lunch yay they saw us feeding the ducks the girls but I'm having them with him and they're so irregular it's really annoying because I'm like oh, could it be could it be could we finally be but no no I only say that because I just had one and then it went away and I waited but nothing <laughs> so oh man the anticipation of not knowing when your baby's coming. I, you know, sort of had that with V, but then I ended up getting induced. And I planned out Erilyn's, so I already knew when she was coming. But now I'm, I'm going to let him come um, whenever he wants to come, though I will not go past too far past my due date. So. The anticipation, the anticipation of wondering if he's coming now, or later, or on his due date, or after his due date, and now I need to get the girls into bed, <laughs> cause it's nap time, and I bet you anything, she dropped her blanket. I will say though that V has been fairly amazing at getting her to stop crying. See, she got her to stop crying. I, I think she's been pretty good at getting her to stop, which has been really nice, seeing as I can't get back there myself. Um, so, thank you, Velasca, for being such a great sissy. Other times she does cry along with her, but <laughs> most of the time she'll try and get her to calm down, whether it be singing or right now they're playing, they're playing with coins and it's distracting Erilyn from what she's crying about. Um, sometimes it's tickling, but she's doing it. And oh my gosh, Erilyn can get the top buckle undone in her seat. 
and it's really annoying because I all I can do is stop and put it back on her but immediately she'll have it right back off ah anyways okay later Thank you.